Hey everybody and welcome to another episode of The Genuine Article. In this week's episode I am doing a wee mini painting. The focus being of creating something that I can paint in one night. <laughs> that was the main main target for this because in my paintings they're quite large, they're quite time consuming. Like my most recent one, Temptation, which there should be a video out for that soon, that took me about two to three months to complete. So I really want to have a balance between creating these large uh, time consuming paintings but then also creating some smaller works which are a bit more experimental where I'm trying out different things. Um, so hopefully by balancing the two I'll hopefully be able to get more videos out but honestly I've, um, <laughs> I've done quite a few sketch videos because I did make one sketch video before uh, where I was talking about doing a daily sketch but uh, and I have been doing a daily sketch, it's just that uh, I'm quite hard on myself and I've probably filmed like six or seven of the processes of some of my sketches, but then when I finish them I'm like, oh, it's terrible, I can't show that on YouTube. Um, so I kind of have this uh, perfectionist mindset where I don't want to show anyone any of my work unless it's my like absolute best work, but I'm that's something, that's a habit or a mindset that I really, really need to break. Like um, I. I'd love to just be brave enough just to post everything. So, um, oh, I guess <laughs> I guess here it goes. <laughs> the couple of things that I wanted to focus on on this one is uh, one, uh, Inktober is coming up, and that has been something that's been on my bucket list forever that I want to do. So, I really wanted to practice inking. So that um, is why I did sort of a, a pen and uh, wash start painting. Um, I also wanted to practice hands and birds because those are the two things that I really want to get better at um, painting. And I also just wanted to just play with different designs. I'm still trying to figure out my style and figure out what elements I want to include in that. So um, I think the best way to do it is just, uh, as everyone says, is just to practice and just keep trying new things. So uh, this piece is definitely very experimental for me. I did have quite a clear image of what I wanted to paint in my mind. I've had this image of, of setting a bird free, um, you know, to symbolize <laughs> setting yourself free, basically. So um, I had this kind of idea <laughs> of like a floating hand. Um, so that's kind of um, my idea going into that this. And then I just, um, so I took all, all, um, all the things which I normally incorporate into a large painting. So sketching, a Photoshop mock-up, transferring the design to a piece of paper and then the painting process so um, I think it's I think hopefully it's going to be really really good for me and will help me learn faster if I'm condensing my whole painting process into something that only takes like a day or so so um, so yeah that's uh there's my little spiel about this painting I, I really hope you guys enjoyed the process and I will see you guys on the next uh, episode uh, bye guys.